What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. My name is Adrian, and today I'm playing Xeno Moon. It's another 616 game and a sci fi horror game, which are three things I really enjoy. So let's play. Eh. I'm here, and I just changed the graphics. Whoa. Okay. The sensitivity. Is there any way that I can change that? Bringing that down to one, dude. That is. Okay. That is much better. Look at this. We're on the moon. What up, Captain Apollo? You have any, anything to say? No? I would simply just pass away, bro. Just gonna stand there. Susan? <laughs> Nothing to say either. We got some oxygen tanks here. Oh, do I got a suit? Put special clothes, yes. Oh, very cool. All right, let me out. Oh. Did I just see something run across the surface? Okay. What up, dude? Is there something you need help with, Mark? Hello, everybody. My of all people, my name is Mark Blair. No. <laughs> all right. What is my objective here? Oh, I there's moon gravity, dude. I love this. This is so cool. <laughs> look at me. Oh, this is so much fun. Oh, look at that. It's the captain just chilling in there. Well, I have fun out here. <laughs> Stay in there. Oh. There's the earth. Okay, I made it up here. There's the base. What is that? Is that the moon? Because maybe we're on a, an asteroid or something. It doesn't really make much sense that the moon would be in the sky if I'm on the moon. Okay, I'm going back in. Can someone explain to me what I need to be doing? Oh, okay. I guess I have to explore these craters. I have to collect soul, soil samples. Soul samples. All right, let's go. Well, I've already blown through a bunch of my oxygen. Uh, I have to get to 2007 NB. The problem is these craters are extremely far away from one another. So that's great. Does this show me where I am on the map? It does. Okay, pretty cool, pretty cool. There's something so fun about this, man, about moon hopping. Everywhere? Am I? going the right way i hope so <laughs> it's kind of hard to tell this place is so big and there's so much going on okay i'm definitely not going the right way i have to face this way and over here but i didn't happen to see anything oh oh my god do you really expect me to go all the way down there alone this is a bad idea uh, idea this isn't even where i need to be all right well how high up will it let me go before it wasn't letting me go. Oh, 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 okay. I thought that was a massive crater. Look at this. Oh, dude. Oh, no. Is this going to hurt? Okay, we're good. Uh, uh, here we go. I don't. I don't like this. It is very nerve wracking, man. And the echoes. Dude, look at how deep I am. Let's just get this done and get the hell out, dude. I think, okay, there's five total samples that I need. I don't like this, man. It is so unbelievably solitary and creepy. Couldn't I have just had a job in the base, not out in the field? I would have preferred to have Susan's position. She could come out here and do this. It doesn't necessarily seem fair to me that I'm the one who has to do this, man. Come on, here we go. Okay, I have 85% oxygen left. I think that should be enough for me to do what I need to do here, but it's in the back of my mind for sure. I, I'm very nervous about, and now I have 84%. Let's, let's get a move on, shall we? I'll be extremely happy the moment I make it out of this gigantic crater. <laughs> This is actually really well done. I love the fact that there's moon gravity that I can jump around floating around in space as well as the sound design down here. It's phenomenal, man. Okay, I'm almost there. I'm almost out of the nightmare. I would prefer to never come back down here ever again. And Susan, if you force me to, I'm bringing you with me. We got a nice view of the earth coming up here though. Okay, where to next? Now I gotta go this way. And I think I'm pointed kind of in the right direction. Okay. This one isn't as bad. There's still five total that I need to get, though. Okay, just do it. Just do it and go. Just do it and go. All right, I'm working on my last one here. Haven't heard anything or seen anything weird since I got into the hole. 
but I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I don't like where this is going. It's very, very unsettling. And I want out of this crater. All right, I think I gotta stop at the base. Yeah, there it is. Oh my God. Please, please bring me the safety of my crew. I already see one of them over there. Come on. It's too slow. And why is it that sometimes when I land, I see like blood. Look, you see that? Mark, you continue chilling there. I'm gonna go inside real quick. I don't like this. On the end. Can I grab another suit? Captain? Apollo? Nava? Susan, come on. You gotta put a suit on. What is up with your face? In fact, I kinda wanna get a better look at that. I don't think I can. It doesn't let me crouch. Susan, you look really weird. All right, well, there's only one place left to go, and it is the furthest away from base, and it seems to possibly be the darkest one. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Starting to get closer, I think it might be in the center of this massive mound over here. Let me see if I can actually... I don't think it's going to let me up there. Yeah, it just drops me right down. Oh God, that was very fast. I gotta make my way around this mound because I'm assuming that maybe there's a way in. What? what was that? Oh no, dude, this has to be it. Yep, oh my God, man, come on, really? This deep? This is a recipe for disaster. Am I gonna die? No. I'm good. All right, let's just hop down here. Let's get all these samples and let's get the hell out of here, man. I really don't like being alone here. Okay, there's only one left. Oh my God, this is this is too much, dude. It's preying on a fear that I didn't really even know that I had. Being down in a deep hole. Okay, I'm out. I'm out. I'm pretty sure I got everything I need. Yeah, I'm checking now and I have all the soil samples, so I gotta go back to base. At least I'm a master navigator. Okay, the echoes are done, which means I'm out of the hole, which means I'm safe? Question mark? Well, I would like to say that the worst of it is over, but I highly doubt that's the case. I have a feeling that it's only just beginning here. All right, we're coming up on base. There's Mark right over there. Still doing absolutely nothing of value for our team. I gotta have a word with the supervisor, with the captain. Sorry, Captain Apollo. Sorry, get me the hell inside, dude. Get me in, please. I'm in. Thank God. Oh, Stefan, I need you to find Mark. He was outside fixing the solar panels and stopped responding. Okay, Captain, oh my God, that's me? I'm going outside to see what happened. Be careful. We don't know what we might find out there. Okay, well, you couldn't get Susan to do it. Captain Apollo, you know, a good captain leads by example and not by direction. So what do you have to say to that? You challenge me, Marvel. <laughs> okay, I'm out of here. Well, with 59% oxygen left, I'm gonna go find Mark. It's blood stain right here. There you are. <laughs> Mark, there's a lot of blood here. What happened to you, friend? I'm gonna go back inside and tell the captain that Mark has been killed in a bloody mess right outside near the solar panels. Captain? Oh, Captain, my Captain. Fuck off! No? Okay. Well, the next thing on my objective list is to find Mark. Is there any way that I can be clued as to where his location might be? Oh, blood. Well, <laughs> here we go. This is exactly what I was expecting. Is he down here? Oh no, there's more. Something definitely dragged him out of here. Oh, I'm gonna stay up in the mountains. We really should have like a team of people doing this. And I see something. I see what appears to be a bloody helmet. <laughs> Here we go. Here comes my death, guys. I hope you're ready. I'm either gonna run out of oxygen or die. Okay, well, yep. I'm, I have nothing to say about that. Got me running around like crazy over here, dude. I am so far away from the base now. I'm going all the way to... Okay, yep, it's leading me into a dead end of misery and hell. Oh, what was... Oh, there it is. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, and I'm going to keep walking towards it? All right, well, I guess so. I know I'm totally in control of the situation right now because I'm the one walking towards what I just saw that somehow phased into the mountain. And there's Mark. All right, well, I'm going to examine his fleshy head. Shit, what's going on here? I need to go back immediately. You got it. I'm going up. I'm going all the way up. 
I'm not gonna, mm, okay, it doesn't want me to go up. Well, here comes my dad. <gasps> here it is. Whatever, what the fuck is that? Okay, 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 okay. It's time to go! Oh my god, this is thing. Whoa! What's gonna happen? Oh, oh, oh! I'm alive! I'm alive with very low health, very low oxygen. I could maybe put a little pep in my step as well, you know? Maybe? My god, what was this? I need oxygen, I need to get back to the base. You got it. I'm incredibly far away. All right, well, you know something? It's got me moving a lot slower. I can't run anymore. In fact, running is the same speed now as my old walking speed. I don't even think I'm gonna go hopping around. I think that's a bad move. Am I gonna make it, dude? Am I actually gonna make it? Or does it not give me enough time to actually make it? Because there's only 6% left. And I am so incredibly far from the base. Why did that alien leave me alive, though? Oh my god, what's gonna happen? I'm almost there. What if I run out of oxygen? Am I gonna die? Alright, I think I'm doing significantly better now of getting there. I don't know why. I think jumping is really not the key. Because it slows me down considerably. I think it's safe to say that this time, though, I'm definitely going to make it. I wonder what the scene is going to be like when I get in here, though. And there's blood. There's already blood all over the window. I think that's the captain smushed up against the glass. So I guess I'm just going to walk right in. Anything's better than dying without oxygen, though. Okay, well, I'm... Captain Susanna, no! What am I going to do now? I'm going to die. Oxygen? Oh! Okay. I need to get to base two. There must be a capsule there to take me back to planet Earth. Base two exists? Would have been nice to know. Okay, let me go. I'm gonna go. I have plenty of oxygen. I have a decent amount of health. I just gotta make sure I go the right way. And I think it's gonna be around this big mountain. The problem is I'm expecting there to be another alien that comes after me and kills me. There's that thing in the sky again. Is it getting big? Oh, dude. You've gotta be kidding me. You've gotta be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. I don't even want to look behind me, man. Dude, what is happening? What is happening? I can't find this base for the life of me. This is so ridiculous, dude. All could have been avoided if we just, one, never came here. And two, had a backup plan of sorts. I guess this is the backup plan. I don't know where these aliens are or if they're even close to me. Come on. Go. I'm actually nervous. Oh, fuck. There's one right there. Go in, go in, go in. What do I do? Interact. Excellent. It worked. I'm going to get in the capsule. Where's the capsule? Oh, is this it? This is it. This is it. This is it. Let me in. Do I go in through the top? No. I'm, I got to find this entrance, man. Okay, maybe here. Yes, yes, yes. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Okay. That was so stressful, dude. So unbelievably stressful. Here I go. I'm out of here. Oh my god, man. And there is an alien. What the fuck is right? Jesus, dude. The thing is massive. I'm dead. <laughs> well. There we go. I died. Not bad at all. It was pretty fun. I like that. A nice little sci-fi horror story, and it really nailed the atmosphere. Especially being down in the craters with the echo and everything, it was so unsettling. I think that was even more unsettling than dealing with these monsters. It was otherwise a pretty bare bones experience, but I still enjoyed it for what it was. I think it did the sci-fi horror theme justice. And yeah, if you guys want to try this out for yourselves, be sure to check the link down below in the description. Otherwise, that's going to be it for me today. Thanks everyone for watching. I appreciate you all for being here and for showing me your support. If you happen to enjoy this video, be sure to hit that like button down below. Leave me a little comment. Let me know how you feel. 
And if you're new to the channel and you like what I'm doing here, please consider subscribing. It really helps me out a lot. Once again, I thank you all so much for watching this video. And I can't wait to see you all in the next one. Take it easy.